Supreme offers underground water storage and septic tanks in vertical and modular designs under the brand name of Amrutam and Safeguard. The Amrutam water tanks are designed to meet the underground water storage requirements whereas the Safeguard septic tanks are designed for on-site and decentralized wastewater treatment. These ready-to-use ready-made tanks offer multiple advantages over the conventionally constructed concrete or brick masonry tanks. As the installation has major influence over the performance of plastic underground tanks, these best engineered tanks need to be installed strictly as per the standard procedures and guidelines. Installation Procedure of Modular Underground Tanks Excavation of the Pit Excavate the pit approximately 600 mm larger than the size of the underground tank. Bed Preparation Prepare a 6 inch thick bed of PCC to provide even, flat and firm foundation for the tank. There should not be any sharp objects or stones etc. which could protrude and puncture the tank. Positioning the first component Lower and position the first modular tank component in the pit. Ensure that it is vertical and centrally positioned. Align it correctly and level it using a spirit level. Place the rubber rings on the holes to make the intermediate pipe connections. Intermediate pipe connections. Apply rubber lubricant on the rubber seals and insert interconnecting pipes and vent pipes. Push the pipes. Push the interconnecting pipes fully inside the first component. Positioning the second component. Lower and align the second component properly. Place the rubber seals and bring it close to the already positioned first component. Alignment of two components. Match the holes of two adjoining components. Push and insert the connecting pipes from inside the first component. Positioning, fixing and alignment of the last component. Place the last component, match and connect it with the intermediate component using connecting pipes. Connection of the last components should be made as per the given chart. Covering the joints. In order to avoid entrance of backfilling material in between the joints of two modular components, wrap the tarpaulin sheet using glue on the joint surface. Pedestal support. To avoid the lateral movement of the tanks, construct a PCC pedestal at both ends at the dome section. Initial backfilling. Backfill carefully using recommended backfilling material up to 400 mm from the bed level. Ensure that no voids should remain, especially under and between the legs of the tank. Final backfilling. At first, fill the tank with water up to one-fourth capacity. Then start the backfilling with recommended material. Backfilling should be carried out simultaneously with water filling and compaction up to maximum tank capacity. Ensure that the backfilling levels should never exceed the water level within the tank. Width of the backfilling should be minimum 300 mm around the tank. Backfill material should be placed in 250 mm thick layers and compacted up to minimum 90% of proctor density. Excavated soil can be used as backfill material if it is sand or soft muram. But in case of black cotton, loamy or marshy soils, only sand, stone dust or gravel of max 10 mm size is recommended. Make the inlet and outlet connections. Make the inlet, outlet and vent connections. Cast the concrete slab at the top and place the cover. Select and place the appropriate cover as per the site loading conditions. In case of light motor vehicular movement, GRP cover of appropriate load class with RCC slab for full width of the tank is recommended. Installation procedure of standalone and vertical tanks will remain same. Follow the simple steps shown in the images. Excavation 
Bed Preparation Prepare a 6-inch thick, even, flat and sufficiently hard bed of granular material and compact it properly. Positioning the tank Lower the tank and position it in the pit. Fill up the tank with water up to one-third capacity. Backfilling Complete the backfilling as per the standard guidelines. Make the inlet, outlet and vent connections. Place the cover of required load class. Please note, maximum depth of installation for underground tanks is 600 mm below ground level. If it exceeds 600 mm or in case of high water table, you are advised to consult our team of experts. Except pipe connections, the installation procedure of Amritam water storage tanks will remain same. To get the desired performance of the tanks, it is necessary to follow the given guidelines. Thank you.